Breaking news we first told you about early this morning. The man wanted for three shootings had his first court hearing just moments ago. Thank you for joining us. I'm Andy Sirota. And I'm Anusha Rasta. Russell Cormier was arrested overnight after several days on the run. Channel 2's Sophia Ojeda is live outside the Harris County Courthouse. And Sophia, charges were read, but Cormier wasn't there. Is that right? Yeah, good morning, Anusha. That's correct. Cormier was not in court this morning. He did not appear before the judge, but still those charges and those details of the alleged crimes, they were read aloud in court. He knows the defendant to be a former neighbor who uh, is the ex-husband of the deceased. 53-year-old Russell Cormier did not appear in magistrate court this morning, but the judge still heard the charges against him laid out by the prosecutor. Cormier, seen here in the back of a Harris County Sheriff's vehicle waving to our camera, was picked up early Friday morning. The U.S. Marshals Gulf Coast Violent Offender Task Force, along with Harris County officials, got a call that Cormier was at Gerber Park in Northeast Houston. He was arrested within minutes. Was taken in without any uh, further uh, violence and without any uh, any problems. Cormier is facing murder for the shooting death of his estranged wife, 61-year-old Fannie McWhite, on Green Canyon Drive Monday morning. He's also accused of gunning down 60-year-old Thornton Bivens hours later. But investigators say he didn't stop there. At his home early Tuesday morning on Shotwell, he confronted his neighbor and shot him several times. That neighbor expected to survive. Evidently, he had been just going from place to place all week. So not having anywhere to stay and uh, finding wherever he could. I mean, he's talked to investigators. I, I can't get into the details yet, but uh, he did tell investigators where, how and, and the particulars of what happened and what caused this, uh, this scene. I just wanted to pause there so you could hear me. Uh, I we are told that Cormier will undergo a mental health evaluation. He is back at the Harris County Jail on $500,000 bond this morning. And uh, investigators tell us that more, charge, more charges are expected in the near future in this case. Reporting live in downtown Houston, Sophia Ojeda, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Sophia, thank you. Police have arrested a man in connection with five.